Hey guys, and welcome back to Hand of Fate. The stakes are raised. The challenges begin. I mean, <laughs> stakes are definitely raised, but hopefully I will not get so screwed this time by the King of Dust. The King of Dust is the perfect implement to ensure your destruction. Uh, let's take a look at our stuff. So... Me Ooh, Ring of Justice. I do want the Ring of Justice. Um... But I don't want to drop any shields. Mm, let's... Uh, Damocles is interesting, but I don't really use it very well. Let's drop Damocles for the Trinket Ring. I want to see how that is. Uh, you're fine. Okay, here. We need to. So yeah, we need food for you. Uh, so this is all good. Uh, let's drop uh, Mr. Lionel, and then I need to throw in uh, Goblin Kings three. Uh, I need these three here. Oh, I see a local peasant uh, if I can. Do, do, do. Um, the maiden is so good. It just, sh just, I can't. I can't drop. I, I need the food. Um, hunting the huntsman. I think we failed that one. So yeah, we're keeping that. And everything else is pretty much new. So okay, we'll, we'll just stick with this for now. Uh, oh, we need one more encounter. Never mind. Uh, let's throw in uh, noble trader. There we go. Uh, that should be good. And let us start the game. <laughs> this is our first king, right? So, yeah, all the dust. All... Do you understand what it is we do now? Or did I rush you through the rules, pushing you into the play before you were prepared? No, no, we're good. Uh, day in Shady Forge, kind of Elf Maiden, ask for supplies. Only one. I'm sure you're grateful for that. Uh, three is pretty good, but one was pretty shitty. Uh, but either way, that's a good start. Devil's Choice. Though I admire his ilk, I live by very different rules. I hope Devil appears in Path, I'm here to test your strength, choose your foe. Um, <clears throat> let's go to Two of Dust. Here we go. It should be an easy battle with a shield and everything. And we should hopefully get a pretty good reward from this. Come here, guys. Hi. What? Did I get... Oh. I was looking at him and it was not paying attention to him. Ah, uh, I can't believe I got hit. That's embarrassing. Against two guys. Ah. Uh, terrible. Terrible. I'm embarrassed. I'm sorry, guys. I, f I failed you. Oh, right. This gold down thing. Three game cards. Three food. Fantastic. Draw two. Select one to keep. Very nice. Ooh. Uh, I think we'll go with Scorching Zeal. This Fire. one has a. F in its multitudinous forms, we still hold it in esteem and wonder. Equipment with the trade burns with the flame of the ancients, doing extra fire damage. However, lava golems will shrug off fire attacks with these. That's fine. We'll add fire and holy. Yeah. Uh, Are you sure that's the right approach? Oh, five max health. Oh, that's real nice. Sweet. Mm, twisted Canyon. Uh, climb down, retrieve the weapon. Here we go. 75%, 75%, number four. Yay! <laughs> okay. I've got Frost Fang. Uh, ours is better. Wait. I didn't equip it, right? I still have the other one equipped, right? No, I don't want to... I want to equip this guy. There we go. Ooh, that looks pretty cool. I think you can see the 3D model. Okay, so let's continue on our... 
forced to escape. Work your way through the woods and see what lies beyond. Hmm. Nice straight path. And an attack. Oh no. Group bands suddenly attacks. That's not bad. Seven of dust. I can deal with that. No problem. Ooh. Okay, come on, guys. <laughs> uh huh. Oh. I wonder how they never attack multiple at once, which is, I guess, I don't know if that's intentional or not, because I presume countering multiple at once would be uh, impossible. You have to dodge. But it doesn't seem like they ever attack uh, two at once. Hmm. Oh well. Doesn't matter. Ooh. Come on, come on, bandits. Come on, come on. What's wrong? What's wrong? You, 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 you can't do this? You can't deal with this? Oh, there we go. Shield look. <laughs> God, I love the shield. <laughs> the counter is the best mechanic in any game. Done. <laughs> That's probably why people say the game mode isn't I mean, the 3D part of the game. The actual combat isn't great. I get nothing out of it. Traveling Tinker. Uh, broke the shop. I want to buy some food with the whatever gold I have now. Uh, or maybe I want to buy a trinket. Uh, let's find out what you have for sale. Uh, can't buy that. Uh, I should be able to, actually, if I want to. Three common strikes staying from bows and wands have a chance to restore your cooldowns. Upon reflecting a projectile, the helm creates a small force explosion. Oh, shit. Uh, once per cap pursuit, I have an aura that makes every six... Uh, let's see. Helm of Reflection is real nice. Using a weapon ability... Uh, I don't have that. Let me see. Mm, if I sell Frostfang for 10, I will have... How much money do I have right now? I have... Uh, oh, 24. I'll have 34. 34 is not enough. So, I'm gonna buy some food. Mm, yeah. Buy some food. And buy some food. Perfect. Yes. I know that I do not buy enough food. So, but let's focus on that, especially since we're dropping uh, gold every time. Battle Are your top. senses acute enough to detect what lies here? Light draws you to a nearby hilltop where you see a warlock disappear in a cloud of sulfur, leaving behind seven minions. Six. Sure. Six bandits to keep you on your toes. That's okay. Come on, guys. Come on. Come here. <laughs> oh, there are traps, it seems. But that's fine. Oh, if, they, if the traps end up hitting them, that sounds even better. <laughs> Come on, guys. Come on. Oh. Oh, come on. Uh, I gotta be careful where I stand, Billy. Okay. Come on. I mean, it will hit them, but as long as I'm careful, I should be fine. Okay. You. Uh, wait, it's not firing anymore? Did it run out of ammo? Actually, can it run out of ammo, I guess? Nice. Beautiful. There goes all our gold. Such a shame, really. Yeah, look to gain. Oh, draw three. Select one to keep. Ooh, healing cap. Um, uh, chains of I want to know what this is. During combat strikes, an sustained. Excellent way to turn an injury into an asset. Uh, 
I mean, sure, it's good. What about healing cap? Any healing that the player Increasing receives Increasing the doubled. effects of one sort of magic with another. All you need is a channel for power, and it's simple enough. Cool. Uh, so now I'll turn game eight. Yeah. Head uh, downwards, if you dare. I figure it's going to be pretty good if Think I about screw the way up somewhere. Play this game. You continue to die, yet we reset the board each time. One has to wonder how it is possible to truly lose. He begs for food to feed the orphans. The gods show favor to those who help the less fortunate. A worthy decision for you to explain. Oh shit, I, I, I can't give you ten food. Uh, do I dare give him five food? Five food will put me at seven. I hopefully will find some... Uh, there's no guarantee. I'll give you five. Only accepts your provisions. Let me see if I have anything in my sack which will reward the generosity. Oh, jeez. I have to now... I might not even get anything from this. Okay, good. Good, good, good. Ah, the priest explains and draws you a tarnished old ring. I have the kids polish it up first. In the meantime, take my blessing. Draws you one game card and card just opens yours. Will of the Gods. Useful. At the start of each combat, a random opponent is highlighted. If that creature is the first to die, then it pops out five gold, which the player may collect. Eh. It is yours. You can take it. This tale begins, and then proceeds relentlessly. With each step, you will discover a new card and a deeper mystery. Oh shit! I have to fight the Jack of Plague? <laughs> uh, okay. Mr. Jack of Plague. That's fine. This is actually a tougher battle than uh, uh, the original one was. Because there's more rats. Oh no, it can't counter you. And. And deal with his unblockable attacks. Uh, no, no, no. Can, can I roll, please? Block. Oh, god damn you, Jack the Plague. Okay. Okay. Okay, we're good. Let me get rid of these guys if I can. Block, block, counter. Okay, we're good. Oh shit, no, 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 Mr. Jack of Plague. No, oh god damn you. There's way too many of you. Okay, come on. Oh, no, god damn it. Not this other thing. Okay, I am way too low in life. I'm very happy, presuming I survived this. I'm very happy that I... Selected the 8 health region. Okay. Good. Okay. Okay, good, 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 good. Okay, focus. Ooh. No, Mr. Jack of Plague. You're going down. Whew. I'm at 4 health. Oh shit. <laughs> oh god. That was much closer than I thought. Oh god. That was a little too tough. One food game cart is fantastic. My food. Okay. That's great. That's great. I'm traveling healer. I mean, would it be would it be lovely if I had the money. Uh but I should be able to use it because I can sell a little bit of stuff. Hmm. So you can heal 15 health for 8. I can sell some stuff. I can sell... Sell the axe. Hmm. And I can sell... If I sell this, I can get 2. If I sell this... Uh, for eight, it was eight a pop. I can get both as well. I sold this guy, 
And then I'm gonna uh, heal wounds. Yeah, it's eight. The uh, pendulum and... can swing both ways. Beautiful. Okay, and we still have ten food. Uh, should be okay. Hopefully, we're gonna be just fine. <laughs> Oh, there's an ambush. You may have to contend with every bandit in the kingdom before you reach the king. Jack of Dust isn't bad with only two skulls. Um, but yeah, seriously, why are we battling so many? Okay. Oh, wait, wait. I just realized, the two skulls? He comes with bandits by himself. Oh shit. Okay. We're good, we're fine. Just keep blocking. Okay. What? I found her. Guess it wasn't in time. Nope, nope, nope. Didn't move. I need better armor. I definitely need better armor. Nope, roll. Good. Oh, shit. Yeah. Okay, my good sir. Okay, can we get this guy now? He gonna hit me. Okay, can we do it now? No, okay. Cannot get a hit again. And we finally got him. Holy shit. Every time a new typical obstacle lies in front of us, uh, sneak up and kill him. Okay. Here we go. 75%, 75%. Uh, you. Shit. Uh, don't get anything. Ooh, the White Council 2. Let us stake a token on their foolishness. One day as you travel through a forest, you come across a band of thugs standing on your roads on the roadside. As you draw near, they move to block your path. Three dust. Two dust. Uh no, uh, hand over half your gold stranger for passing through the forest. The White Council demands it. No, refuse. The White Council doesn't like armed mercenaries wandering through their land. The man says a goons closing around you. That's fine. I only have 19 health, but uh, there's no like big boss man here, so uh, hopefully we're fine. This, is, yeah, this should I, I should be able to deal with absolutely no problems just by countering. There we go. Oh, God, stop that! Yeah, it doesn't seem like. Oh wow! Yeah, no, they got through. So that means they can attack multiple at once. Um, so if I'm super unlucky, then, then that's just how it's gonna be. But, yeah, it seems like it's gonna be fine. Yeah. Oh! I got the gold! From the, uh, my blessing. Oh, that's one thing I, I should have s Oh no, I couldn't have sold my blessing, could I? I don't remember seeing an option to sell the blessing. Hmm. I guess it's fine. That's my fault. As you approach uh, one of the fallen men, he says with some effort, "They'll regret this. There will be consequences." He cuts off his voice uh, as his voice fails him. You notice a rope figure standing in the shadows of the forest. He waves his hand, and a magical portal appears. Stepping through it, he is quickly gone. You look around to find no trace of the fight remains. The stone is now yours. Sweet. Very nice. Or escape, basically. Roaming ever forward, hunting for the truth. This is basically restore eight health. All the world is a game board, <laughs> and us men and women merely players. I alone do not play. I maintain the rules. You have choices, and I have predestination. Your choices, though, are merely a rediscovery of that. You already know. 
Hmm, is it though? In a shady grove off the beaten trail, you find a traveling merchant looking to trade with one of the Um, let's see what he has. Uh, again, I can sell some stuff, so he probably can heal. Which probably would be pretty good. Um, I can buy some food, uh, but I don't think I need it. I can sell Frostfang for 10. That'll put me at 14 gold. Um, uh, hmm, 14 would put me, um, enough to heal. You know what? I think I will do that. Let's, uh, sell Frostfang. And then heal wounds. Uh, let's heal... Yeah, heal this. Plus 30 health, because everything's doubled. He's very good. Uh, and I have four gold left, which is... Oh, that's enough for one food. Beautiful. Yep. Leave. Uh, seven food. Let me... Three. Okay, that's plenty of food. Alicia in Underworld. I will have to wager on the outcome. I do not think you have what it takes. Ah. Uh, every time. I cannot get her the freaking stuff. Ooh, Goblin King's Hall 3. This token will unlock more cards if you can defeat this encounter. Holy lad. The enigmatic goblin, Mr. Lionel, climbs out of a bear behind a tavern as you pass through a small village. I have made some refinements to the magic device, and I think we'll do better this time if we take another shot at these treasure vaults. You see, goblins sometimes hide their best treasure, magic items, and such like. Enchanted treasure chest, magic amulet will now reveal those to you. If there should... If there should chance to be one in any treasure vault, we happen to visit. Yeah, sure. We say, lad, shall we have another shot of the Goblin King's tree? Yeah, sure. Good lad, let's go right now. I think I've located one in the desert not far from here. Under the blazing sun of nameless desert, you and the Goblin find a door, partially buried beneath the shifting sands. You can keep whatever gold you recover, but remember to look around for treasure chests. They're sure to hold something worthwhile. Cool, this is going to be another one of the traps. Um, really without enemies. But the main thing is I can keep the gold and recover. Okay. So here we gotta be careful. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Oof. Oh, God, crap. That was really bad. Oh crap. I see what's going on here. What? Okay. Ooh. Okay, just carefully. Carefully. Okay, made to the stairs. Is that it? Or no chest? It's not looks disappointed as you report your failure in finding any treasure chests. There must be one there somewhere. You're not looking hard enough. He stalks off to the desert and quickly disappears among the dunes. Oh, did I miss it? Well. Ah, well. The Devil's Carnival. Frivolity is not my forte. One day, just as dust gathered, you reach a large country town hosting a traveling circus. Strange sights and stranger smells confront you as you begin to wonder tents and smells. Uh, if this is the one we've been through, yeah. Yeah, it's the. It's the fake carnival where we're gonna be attacked in a moment. Oh, huge success! Holy shit! Uh, cheers and gas dry you to a large tent. Inside, you discover a number of spectacles being performed by costumed artists. Oh, great. Gotta do it one more time. Uh, oh my god, another huge success. 
Along the back of the large tent, you discover a row of cages. Strange creatures look at you mournfully through the bars. You stop at the sight of a beast with the body of a lion and the head of a man. Please help me, the beast explains. I was born a man, but then I came here. They did this to me. You open the cage, and the beast jumps out, saying, Bless you, stranger. I may live out my days as an animal, but at least I won't have to perform for those devils. Draw one lesson card. I made Any that hit? a little too powerful. I will have to Any rebalance hit? that next time. Any hit on the player during combat has a chance to poison it. Oh, shit, that's really good. Car is now yours. Now, sometime later, you find yourself standing at the edge of a forest. The sounds of the crowds behind you. Day is just dawning. But which day? Looking back, you see the ruined buildings of country town long ago abandoned. Damn! Doubles! Huge success! Real nice. Noble traitor. Noble in mind, or simply noble by birth. A nobleman approaches on a chariot. As you walk the streets of Stigal, he notices you and comes to a stop. Greetings, mercenary. I am collector of rare weapons, and yours intrigues me. Would you part with it for gold? Uh, no. I don't have a backup. Um. He rides away. Yeah, that's fine. I don't have a good backup, so that's not happening. With only Batman. three food, you'd better hope to finish this quickly, or hunger will finish it for you. I am definitely hoping for that. Uh. Okay. Okay. I just move away. No, bad rat. Bad rat. Okay, enough of this. Okay, is that one down? I hope so. Oh no, 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 stop it. Stop it, stop it, guy, stop it, stop it. Damn you bastards. Oh, no, shit. Wow, I actually managed to counter that in time. That's amazing. I didn't even think I could do that. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. Okay. Okay. We're fine. Somewhat. We are losing a lot of health. We're losing a lot of health. Stop the poisoning. Stop it. We suck. Pigeon with 29 health. Oh. Super bad. Super bad. Um. Gang cards. I mean, this is great. Presuming I'm sure you're that, grateful for that. Only if it continues further. Uh, oh, and it does. So yes, I'm very grateful for that. Uh, yeah, because of the cave. On this floor, the King of Dust waits for you. He is I prepared. Presume. Are you? No. Uh, hunting the Huntsman. Oh, There's here a we token go. in it for you if you win. Um. Uh, it's not too hard to track down the Huntsman, who's on Crusade. Um, right. 25% chance. Uh, you. Ah, at least I didn't go with a huge failure. Ground is fierce beneath your feet. Uh, okay, I have a chance to... A choice. Select your desire. Okay, good. Uh, you... You catch the edge of the pit with a firm grasp and manage to haul yourself up to the solid ground. In front of you stands a grizzled veteran hunter, adorned with many trophies from his kills. He moves with calm assurance and his gaze pierces you like a dagger. I am impressed that you escaped my trap. In fairness, it was not designed for one such as you, but someone more substantial. Having spent so many years in the role of a hunter, it is unusual to find myself as prey. Let us share a drink at the tavern, where we can converse as men instead of tracking each other's footprints like beasts. Take it. Nice. So we probably got the next step. Okay, we got a shop. It's good, 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 good. Uh, first the shop. Mm, five food. Uh, I think we need a little bit more food. 
Because if you have to do backtracking, it's not those. Um, it's gonna end up badly. But... Uh, healing for 20... Uh, healing... For 20... Is really good. So let's do that. Use us with 5. Which leaves us... Allows me to buy one food. Okay. Cool. That should be good enough. Hopefully. Ugh. <laughs> now... Treasure chest. A treasure chest. What more What's... iconic emblem of success could we imagine? Uh, not a mimic. While exploring a dungeon, you see a treasure chest at the end of the hall. Just my whole great wealth, but the chamber may be trapped. Oh, shit. Ooh. Uh. Uh, you. Ah. Even for difference. The room begins to fall with deadly gas. Attempt to escape the gas. Oh, God. You. Oh, success. You dive through the billow clouds and reach the other side safely. Your frozen treasure chest. Win this and claim my token. A, che a treasure chest looks better, but still intact. What treasure might it hold? Uh, time to try another one. Okay. Let's do this. You. Oh, come on. Why? Why? God. Ah. Oh, well. Found the king of dust. Very few yeah. are so foolish as to deliver themselves to the king. The king is fierce in battle, but is lo but loyal to his troops. He can choose to heal them during combat. A challenge for you, and a token if you succeed. Well, uh, wait, how many troops does he start with? Oh, four of dust, okay. That's not too bad. Uh, here's the king himself. King of dust. Oh, look how, look at that majestic beard. Mm. Okay. Whoa! So he drops explosives. Okay. So I basically need to kill these guys as quickly as possible. Uh, because if I don't, he will. They will actually come back, nice and healthy. Oh no no. Okay, good. Alanar, just just kill these guys, and then this should be a lot easier. Okay. I think that one's down. We're good. Oh shit! I did not mean to get a hit. Come on. Okay. Wait, there's no one. There's no one alive now. <laughs> yeah, hit yourself. Ooh. 14 damage hit. Okay, that's not a joke. <laughs> What's wrong? What's wrong, Mr. King? Come on. Come on, Mr. King. Come on. Come on, Mr. King. What's wrong? <laughs> that was actually a pretty simple fight. <laughs> <laughs> there goes for gold again. <laughs> there are many who will be pleased that you have defeated the likes of my lesser king. As for me, I think you have but proven that I must defeat you entirely. A set of new trinkets for you. You will need them and more. For defending, uh, for donating food to the orphans, buy food, charity too. And rank of poverty. For standing up to the White Council thugs, I receive the White Council three. For freeing a victim of the Devil's Carnival, you receive twenty gold and giant eagle. Interesting. For escaping in the Huntsman trap, you receive the mug and the barrel. 
reward for defeating my band of king, I receive feather ice, life's climb, jack of scales, hero's remains, stranger in the shadows, and old graveyard. Come, very come nice. Come more to the game. <laughs> I think that's a success. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Next up, I guess we can take on that Jack, or maybe another King. Who knows? Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.